Hello, I'm Dr. Christopher Williams, and just want to continue with our orthodontic series. Uh, in most cases, the bottom jaw, which we know as the mandible, fits snugly inside of the top jaw, which we call the maxilla. Sometimes this relationship gets out of the gets out of proportion, or it's uh, the relationship's not right, and the bottom jaw has a tooth or teeth that extend beyond the top jaw. We call this a crossbite. It can be in the front or it can be in the back where the teeth just don't fit together the right way. There's usually a simple way that we can improve this relationship and help uh, a young person's bite get back on track. And we call that expansion of the jaw, rapid palatal expansion, or we use an RPE. So the first step that we will do is to play spacer so we can try on Bands. We like to have the right tooth fit snugly on the bands as you've seen in our last video with the molar bands. We make sure that it gets to be seated all the way down. Then we take an impression with the bands in. We call this a pickup impression. These impressions are prepared and sent to the lab for fabrication of the appliance. Once the appliance comes back from the laboratory, we are all set to get ready to deliver the appliance. The first step is preparing the teeth. We like to publish the teeth and make smooth surfaces. Then we try in the appliance first to make sure that it fits in the mouth the way that it did on the model. a look at the completed appliance once it's been placed. The next thing is for us to show the parent how to activate the appliance at their home. We appreciate you taking a look at our video. We hope it's been informative. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to drop them down. Also feel free to give our videos a like and a share. Thanks for checking us out.